would say the best thing that um, someone's ever told me was uh, my dad. He told me that struggle builds character. And um, that's something I live by every day, whether it's in your life, whether it's in school. Um, you're going to struggle at some point, and um, that determines your character, that builds your character. Who are you when you're struggling? Um, how do you get past it? Um, and it's just something that goes for football, school, and life for me. And uh, my dad, he, growing up, he had cancer for a while and struggled build built his character. And uh, now he's just just passing on to everyone else. So struggle builds character is probably the best advice that someone's ever given me. Probably my dad when I was really little. Um, he just told me anything that I wanted, I had I had to work for it. And um, one guy that he uh, grew up on was Walter Payton, and he. I knew everything about him because my dad was just a huge fan and one thing that he loved about him was his work ethic and just how he carried himself and um, my dad kept pushing that on me. You have to work hard and you have to work to get what you want and um, ever since then I've been working my butt off and uh, it's paid off uh, thus far. Finish what you started. That was kind of one of the things my dad always hit home on. Just, you know, you don't start something and not finish it and if you're going to do something just do it to the best of your ability always and uh, never sell yourself short. So that would, that's probably what I go by. I would say to to never give up. Um, I always keep pushing, and when you set a goal, uh, make sure you accomplish it, and then set another one. I always stay hungry and and sat, never get satisfied. Basically, really, just chase your dreams. You know, do what makes you happy, and and do it to your best ability. You know, don't don't look back. Just do what you do what you want to do, and and. Do it all the way, you know, chase your dreams. In life, just keep God first and you will go a long way. And that's one thing. In, in college, I could easily be out here partying, just forget about everything else. Not, but one thing I always do is just go to church and just always trying to keep him first in everything I do. And that's why I, I feel like I've been successful in everything I've been doing throughout my life so far. Uh, best life advice is... Uh, just it's not what happens to you, but how you respond to it, and I think that can carry over to the football field as well. But uh, on the on the football field, my my best advice uh, would probably just just be to chase my dreams. Um, if you want to do something, just put your mind to it, and then if you do that, you'll be able to succeed in, in whatever you're trying to accomplish. Uh, every day counts. Um, you know, it seems like yesterday I just signed my uh, letter of intent. And, you know, every day really does count. And it takes a while for that to set in. And uh, it takes a while. When you're sitting in my position, you're going on your last year, you, uh, you believe it. <laughs> so, yeah, that's probably definitely the best. To, to never, uh, uh, it's, it's going to seem very, it's going to seem very generic, but to never spend more than you can afford. In Albania, it seems a little more clever. But that's, but basically, and it's not just about money, but it is about money, but it's about life. And, you know, to always plan ahead and to always, know what you're capable of and to always measure your next step and I think that's something that it's very it's general so it's, you know very uh, common to say but it makes sense when you put it in the bigger picture. I would say my, my grandma gave me um, a good um, good word of advice she said she told me when I was young um, to if you're gonna do something do it all the way don't have do anything and everything might not be as easy as you want to uh, want it to be, but in the end, it'll be it, uh, the hard work will pay off. So I would say that that stuck with me my whole life. I would say stay humble, you know, because in life, you know, you're gonna have your different, you're gonna have your ups and downs, you know, and you got you're gonna have your time when you're riding high, and you know, you still gotta remember where you came from, you know. Everybody starts somewhere in anything they do. And in football, it's the same way, you know. We're, people feel like we're at the top right now, and, you know, we just got to stay humble and keep doing what we've been doing, you know, this whole time to get where we were, get where we were at. You know, it's, it's, a long, it's been a long process, and, you know, it's been a long road here. Coach Creighton, uh definition of what leadership is is the uh, ability to influence others, and that's just kind of stuck with me. And I try to carry that to workouts and try to have that rub off on my teammates. Just my ability that what I do impacts my teammates, and what they see me do is what they want to do. So I just try to bring that mentality and attitude to every workout and practice.